All right, we're going to do, I tried to go on TikTok, but it is just not happening. So we are going to do, oops, I'm pressing buttons over here. We are going to do um, the alphabet table for live. Okay. And this table is for my daughter's daycare. She um she helped me put the blocks in here and stuff like that. So like I said, I tried to go on TikTok, but it's raining so damn hard. Let me get on TikTok and Facebook and let them know that I switched over here real quick, you guys. Sir, I already did one um, bucket of resin in here, so I'm not going to take forever, though, because I know that would be boring to you guys, and live videos are just a little bit drawn out <laughs> already, so let's see, TikTok. live in youtube for the alphabet table for sorry you guys i tried to do tiktok live but the service was janky because it's pouring outside so youtube it is Sorry guys, I'll let you see what I'm doing. I'm not just I'll hurry up and get this done because I got so much to do. Alright, I'm done. Sorry about that, guys. So the resin that I'm using is from Incredible Solutions.
So this one right here, this is the resin that I'm using, this one, and the coupon code for this is FLUIDWOOD20, F-L-U-I-D-W-O-O-D-20, and this resin is so amazing. Set up for the four again. And we'll go here. And then we'll set up this camera for the TikTok video because I do TikTok religiously. Alright. I really like how the blocks are darkening up after pouring. Like, I really like that. When you pour, when you mix epoxy, make sure that you, um, I'm getting the feeling back in the right side of my face and it feels so good. Like, I never thought I'd be that happy to be able to smile. Like, I miss my smile. And I've heard that it doesn't go back the same, but I don't even care. Like, I just want to smile. This is such a humbling experience having Bell's Palsy. Like, it just really is. This is not something that I ever planned on having. And I'm sure that doesn't, like, you just, like, where, what even happens? How does that even happen? There we go. Oh shit, we got a floating H. Stay there. <laughs> and a J. No good. Let me try suction these down. So I'll probably not pour any more. Just because I don't want these to float and I want this to cure. So I'm going to pour on the outside. And that's it. Just because I want to be sure that this is like perfect. So to keep the blocks down, I used CA glue, but and I checked, but I think I just poured too fast. Um, honestly, that's probably just what happened. I just poured too fast. So let's get these back down, and they should stay like they should stay <laughs> if not I'll have to clamp them down in some kind of way do we have anything else floating nope. that's it so we got an H and a J <laughs> just the H and the J are floating that's it but they're not floating now so maybe just maybe I'm gonna let this cure until it's tacky, like not, so that way it's like not moving. And then um, I'm gonna pour on the outsides 
But I'm going to let this cure for about probably 24 hours. And then I will come back and, um, yeah, because these are popping up. So we got this one and this one. But I got a fix for that. And this is why you wear gloves. So, that shit looks by y'all. Let's go get the torch and, um, let's get the torch. Oh, it's raining. Say hi, Kilo. These, these are from Turkey. These are olive wood. Check this one out. What's my camera doing? There we go. This is one of my favorites. Like, this shit is so pretty. Alright, let's go pop some bubbles. Don't mind the kids making their messes. So I'm going to let this cure for about 30 hours and then I'll come back and I'll pour again. I just don't want things floating and moving and doing crazy stuff. So we do have two floaters. We got the H and the E. It was the J, but I got the J back down. Um, so basically, if I can't keep it down, I'll put a block in shipping tape and then put a weight on it and just keep it down like that. It's not a big deal at all. I knew that they were going to do that. That's why I did. I. I anchored them with CA glue, but it just must not have took on those ones. No biggie. My baby helped me with this table, put the blocks in and stuff, and she was so happy. She kept singing and singing, like, twinkle, twinkle and stuff like that. It was so cute. Alright. So, I'm just going to let this do its thing for a while. And when it starts to cure, I'll come back and I'll push those blocks down but for now it's not a big deal this is going to be liquid for about 24 hours <clears throat> about 30 hours probably so no biggie but as you can see um these ones right here you see how they're floating not a big deal but we're gonna get them down oh the r2 all the other ones are good though which I, I'm glad the other ones are good because it would be a mess if they all floated. That's why I used this right here. I did a dab of CA glue and then I sprayed the resin with the activator and that stuck them down. But that shit looks good. Looks good. Alright, I will try to get part one of this so that way it's not so just long <laughs> and drawn out. Um, live videos are typically like that so um but I'm gonna get this done and I will get some videos up this weekend hopefully